On every single day of the Russian invasion of Ukraine, we've brought you the most visible, most defining images of the horrors of this conflict, the horrors of this war. It's time to see the latest haunting images that have come to shock the world from ground zero in Ukraine. Image number one on day 26, a huge explosion took place in Rivne in western Ukraine after Russia carried out missile strikes in that city for the first time. Two missiles hit a training ground in Rivne. No casualties have been reported so far. It was captured on night CCTV camera. The second defining image on day 26, Russia's invasion of Ukraine continues to bleed lives. Horrifying pictures of a shell hitting a shopping center in the Ukrainian capital, Kyiv. The explosion was very intense. The wave blew out windows in neighboring houses as well, causing massive damage to the nearby areas. Big defining image number three on day 26, as civilian complexes continue to be targeted by Russian forces, pictures of devastation of a residential complex once again in the capital, Kyiv. This is the aftermath of heavy shelling on residential buildings left in piles of debris. Defining image number four on day 26. In the key Ukrainian cities, Russia has upped its offensive. It's very plain to see. Images on your screen show destruction of buildings and homes in the city of Mariupol in the east after incessant missile attacks, resulting in many civilian casualties after this constant bombardment. Big defining image number five on day 26, pictures of the aftermath of heavy shelling once again in Mariupol city in the east. Destruction, devastation followed after this particular attack, leaving the city in ruins. Relief services continue to evacuate the injured, trying to rescue as many people as possible. Thousands continue to remain inside, inside the city. Defining image number six on day 26, the video clip on your screen is from the Ukrainian city of Kherson uh, on the Black Sea coast where anti-war protests have broken out. Demonstrators wearing Ukrainian flags seen chanting, go home, while confronting Russian military vehicles, which were seen turning around and leaving. Listen in. Defining image number seven on day 26. This image on your screen is of Kyiv's mayor and former heavyweight boxing champion of the world, Vitaly Klitschko, showing damage to a residential building that was hit by Russian shelling amidst this particular part of the operation. <laughs> Moving on to images from your screen, on your screen from Poland's Krakow, where Ukrainian refugees are guided by volunteers to reach a train to Berlin at the main train station after fleeing the Russian operations in their home country. Most of them don't think they'll ever be able to return. Defining image number nine on day 26, hundreds have been protesting in Spain's capital, Madrid, against Russia's invasion of their country, holding placards, pleading peace, and chanting slogans against the Russian president, protesters marched to Puerta del Sol in the Spanish capital. Defining image number 10 on day 26, to understand the gravity of the attacks by Russian ground troops. Pictures from the Ukrainian city of Irpin, which is a residential suburb on the outskirts of Kyiv, where a residential neighborhood can be seen bombed, bombarded in a fire from shelling, large plumes of smoke rising into the air. This is a residential suburb of Kyiv that's being targeted in this latest round of attacks. Defining image number 11 on day 26 as civilians free, flee their war-torn country. Ukrainian refugees continue to stream into the European Union's eastern flank via Poland's Medica crossing after the opening of green corridors there. Thousands more are waiting to cross as we speak. Defining image number 12 on day 26, the Ukraine military attacked a Russian warship near the Odessa coast on the Black Sea. 
The video shows a pillar of smoke rise from the sea after the ship was apparently struck by Ukrainian forces.